Hi friends, welcome back to the channel. Today I am going to be continuing my organizing series. If you missed my other two videos that I posted um, within the last week, I will put them in the description box below. But today we are going to be organizing under the bathroom sink. And um, there's not a whole lot to do. I'm a fairly, fairly organized person, but there's always some upkeep and maintenance, so we'll see what we can find under there to uh, kind of purge and organize. The other organizing videos that I did were the laundry room closet and the guest room closet. So if you want to take a look at those, like I said, I will link them in the description box below. So let me turn the camera around and let's get started. Okay, so I have managed to um, get down on the floor. Let's see if I can get back up when we're done. <laughs> but let's get started. I'm just going to start pulling things out and... Um, See what we have. I guess we'll work from right to left. That makes the most sense, right? Um, so I have some shampoo and conditioner and this belongs, I bought this for when my sister and brother-in-law visit. So I need to put this in the pool bath because um, they will need that when they come um, next month. So that's exciting. I'm really excited. So I'll set those up on the counter. I just bought this hairspray. Oh, and this one. Um, I don't know. I This one's okay. Uh, this one, not so much. It was a cheapie at Walmart, but I'll use it because, you know, can't waste things. This is the one I'm working on, the Pantene one I'm working on finishing up. It has a little bit left, but I like this one. This one has a good hold. Um, but all right, so that's my hairspray department. Um, my handy dandy mirror that I use call it my rear view mirror uh, every day when I do my hair. So we'll put that back in there. This tissue box can be relocated. I keep tissues uh, on the closet shelf. So I will put that up there. <clears throat> this, <laughs> this is a package of um, makeup brushes that I bought because I bought some, um, uh, some powder that um, I needed a brush for, so I haven't opened this yet, but I'll set this to the side because I will be using that. All right, then we have my spare curling iron and um, my spare straightener. I had to buy another one um, because I left these <laughs> at my sister's house one time. I'm going to grab this handy dandy have you guys seen these they're called um something ties anyway they are wonderful um at corralling all this mess of the cord so i always like to um to wind up my cord and use i have a ton of these um for my appliances that i don't always use but they are so handy. They're bendable and twisty. I got them from Amazon and they're pretty cheap and they have the longer ones for uh, longer, you know, thicker cords, but they are wonderful. So, yep, that's all um, together. This one, <laughs> I'm sure my sister tied that up for me. She's very um, neat and organized and thank you. <laughs> All right, um, and then I have a bag of cotton balls that I'm going to get a Ziploc to put this in a smaller bag because that just takes up so much room. Then I have my little caddy of um, nail polish remover and just a few nail polishes. These are pretty colors, aren't they? I love those. And my daughter just got, I don't use a lot of nail polish these days, but my daughter just got me this one. So that's what I have on my toes now. Very pretty color. Um, I used to have quite an extensive collection of polish, but have pared it down. So, yep, I just have it in this plastic container, which that will stay there, but I will condense the cotton balls. Then we have some um, sunscreen. Yeah, and then I have another thing of sunscreen, <laughs> both unopened. Uh, it's good to keep them in here because um, 
sometimes when I go out to the pool, I can exit from our slider here. So I will keep those under here. I have some lotion that my daughter just gave me, I think for my birthday or Mother's Day. It smells really nice, but I'm not using this one right now. Actually, I want to use, I want to put this on my nightstand, this Lubriderm. I really like this one. It really is nice and creamy and not oily for my hands. So I like to put that on my hands before bed. And I have some Epsom salt, lavender, and uh, some bath oil aches and pains. So that will go back in there in a second. I seem to have a lot of hand soap here. I thought there was another one. Um, this can go um, in the guest bath. Um, I'm gonna relocate that. This can stay under here because I do, actually, I'm gonna set this back on my sink. I do like this one. My daughter actually bought this for me too. It's lemon and mint. Um, not sure if she got this at Target. Seems like Target or Walmart, but it smells really nice. I stuck it under there for a minute, but yep, I'll put that back on my counter. All right, now for this basket. Oh boy, let's see, let's see what's in here. <laughs> Treasures, I'm sure. Um, shaving stuff. I'm not sure what this lid goes to. <laughs> Probably something I don't have. Um, some soap that a friend of mine gave me and Actually, she gave me um, the sponge as well. I should put the sponge in here. I'm not using that right now, but this soap smells so nice. I have one in the shower now, and this one is coconut milk and olive oil. Mm, very nice. She got it at a specialty soap place by the beach. This one is goat's milk and olive oil sweet pea. They're all so nice. And this one is lemongrass. Oh, that's one of my favorite, favorite scents. Cute little gift bag too. So I will put all that together since I'm not using the natural sponge at the moment. Um, let's see, what else is in this bag, bottom basket? Some tissues. I can actually put these in my purse because I am running low. So I'll put those up on the counter. Um, <laughs> these are the pads for my TENS unit. Um, so yeah, I didn't know those were under here. And then I love this stuff, you guys. Have you seen this? I have, <laughs> not sure why, but I have three, three of these. Yeah, I will not be running low. Actually, I should stick some of these, uh, this one's already open. I'll put this back in the shower because I like to use this. It's a three minute miracle. And um, if you need extra conditioning for your hair, this is super simple. Leave it in for three minutes after you shampoo. And oh my goodness, my hair turns out so soft. Highly recommend this. And because I have curly hair, this um, my hair needs that extra moisture. So yeah, I have, I must have bought them and forgot I had another one. Oh. This is some mousse, volumizing mousse. I need this actually. I'm gonna put this, I have a, a cart to the side here that I have my hair products in and I will put that out there. I didn't know I had that. See, that's why you have to sort through stuff. You forget stuff that you have. Um, a bar of soap. This smells really nice, it's lemon. <laughs> Not using that at the moment. And look at that, it's an international um, charger. So, uh, let's see. And a toothbrush um, charger that this goes on, which I will probably put that in the other basket. All right, so that's that. Um, let's see what we can put back in here. I'll put my sunscreen here. It's nice to kind of corral things with baskets. Um, as long as you don't forget what's in there, right? All right, I think, I think that's good for this basket. The tie came un, untied. All right, so that, those are items that I don't really use all the time. So I'm gonna put that toward the back, which is fine. Actually, if I put it 
sideways. It's pretty heavy. <laughs> there. All right, that fits better. Let's see, can I put the lotion in there? That'll fit good enough. Um, I'll put the, the Epsom salt uh, to the back. I don't use that all the time. Then I have <clears throat> some paper towels and my Mrs. Myers cleaner for whenever I have to clean the counter or whatever in here. So I'm gonna set those to the side. Actually, I could put that toward the back. I don't use that all the time. And then we have another basket. Let's see what treasures are in here. I'm sure it's nothing <laughs> not spectacular, but let's see. I have some conditioner. Um, right now I have other conditioner in the shower, so I don't need that right now. Oh yes, I have some hand soap. I'm not sure if my daughter gave me this also, or I don't remember buying this. This is lemon and mandarin, and it smells really nice. I love lemon. Do you see a trend here? Mm, wow, that's nice and fresh. Actually, I think I'll put that up on my sink for now and put the other one back under here <laughs> for later. Oh, and then I have some other bath oil. This is rose scented and this is really nice. So sometimes when I take a bath, I'll put that in there. That's really nice. Um, actually, I should put it with my other bath oil, that basket. I have some bobby pins that I never use. <laughs> I've had these for a very long time and I think I can get rid of these. Um, my hair's short. I don't really need them. Uh, I have a little, little soap dish. Um, don't really need this. I think I can part with that or possibly put that in the other bathroom, the pool bath. Oh, I love these EOS um, lip moisturizers. I have this um, little hair trimmer. Sometimes I'll use that for my eyebrows, although I mostly get that done with my hairdresser. A bath pillow that I have never used and I probably won't, so I think I can get rid of that. I don't think I need that. And, oh, more bath oil. This one is Tuscan Bo Bouquet. Let's see with argon oil. Oh, that smells really nice. I should remember this the next time I take a bath. <laughs> All right, so let's see if we can put stuff back in my little basket. Um, I think, so I don't forget about this, I'm gonna put this with my make in the drawer with my makeup. So I'm gonna put that up there. All right, let's see what we can put back in the basket. Um, I'm going to put this extra hairspray in there as well. I have this water bottle um, for when I just need to wet my hair, although I have not been using it for quite some time, but I'll, I will put it back in my basket for now. Um, yeah. And then I have some mouthwash that I think this needs to go. I think that can be tossed because I've had that for too long. Um, oh my goodness, let's see if I can get to what is in the very back here. Let me resituate the, the camera just a little bit. Sorry about that. Let's see if we can reach this. Oh, more hand soap. I'm going to put this in the pool bath, so I'm going to put that up top there. Um, this is, oh, spearmint uh, Epsom salt. I guess if I just needed to soak my feet, I, uh, I wouldn't necessarily take a whole bath this but I think I can let go of this because I do not foresee um, me using that I think we bought that originally for my dad um, and then he didn't use it my leg is falling asleep here you guys <laughs> oh my goodness let's see what is back here uh my favorite this is my favorite soap that I use every night to wash my face the rose scented dove and trash <laughs> and then I have these um, Tupperware have you guys seen these I love these just little containers what do I have oh <laughs> there's another container look at that 
<laughs> I love these, and yet I hardly ever use them, but they're great for traveling. Sometimes I would just put some little jewelry in this one or even hair ties. I really should remember that they're here. They're very nice and sturdy. I've used uh, also this for soap containers, so yeah. All right, so that can stay toward the back. Let's see if we can resituate things and um, call this a day. I'm gonna put this all the way to the back. And then I have this CeraVe hand cream. I wanna keep this somewhat toward the front um, because I do, I do like this. Um, it's just that I have other lotion that I'm using right now. Oops, I'll put that over there. All right, so put the hairspray and my mirror um, to the right here because that's what I grab every day. And then I have my, my toothbrush, which I will put in that basket with the charger. And then that leaves me with my brushes that I will use um, at some point. I think I'll put them here to the right as well. All right. And then I just have hair stuff, um, which I think I can stick these in the basket here. I think that will work. Just putting them kind of upside down for now. It's nice to have a backup in case my current um, <laughs> curling iron breaks. And then I have my nail stuff I'll just put there. And like I said, I'm going to condense this. So I think I have done a pretty good job of, um, you know, clearing things away that we don't use. And um, then I just have to relocate some things. So that's that. I know where everything is. Sometimes you just have to kind of revisit what you have and what you're using and not using and just kind of sort through things. So I feel good. I know what's under here. So now let me see what's under hubby's side of the sink. All right. So I was able to get up off the floor <laughs> after cleaning out my side of the underneath the bathroom sink. Now we are going to um, see about hubby's side. So let me uh, reposition the camera and so you can see what we have going on over here. So not too much, really. Um, let's see. Bins here are my husband's uh, shoe polish for his dress shoes, some bath items, which, and, and then first aid. Um, Alcohol prep wipes. I don't even remember what this is from, but I'm sure they're still good. Um, set that aside. The first aid bin is pretty full. Just band-aids, your normal stuff. Um, what is in this bath bin? Um, well, we have some Thermacare packs. Um, oh. <laughs> some hot, cold compresses, which... Actually, I should put these in the freezer. These are great, um, but we don't always need them, but they are good if somebody hurts themselves. So I will put those in the freezer. Um, let's see, what else do we have in here? We have um, some shower caps from hotels. <laughs> Actually, I saved these because when we travel, I put our shoes in these to uh, keep our clothes clean. And then we have um, the Weight Watcher scale that I really don't like. Um, the pamphlet, which I think I can get rid of that trash. Some baby powder for when we go to the beach. Helps to get the sand off the feet. And then, like I said, the Thermacare patch. Um, which actually, I'll put the alcohol wipes in this too. This is becoming a miscellaneous more so first aid spray. I think I'll just put that in there for now. All right. So that's the bins. There's some cleaning wipes at the back. Those can stay there as well as some bleach spray. Um, this razor is for, um, for my dad. I will put that there. It's never been opened. I think I can toss the paper towel. Um, all right, so I'm gonna put the bins back. I'll have to relabel the bath bin to um, miscellaneous, but 
Anyway, those seem to kind of keep the those things corralled. Some air freshener. I like this one. This is Fresh Harvest Pumpkin. Very nice. And then, because we went to Sam's Club, we, we bought a three pack of these, which is like, oh my gosh, it's, I don't know, five to seven year supply, I feel like. I'm going to set this up on the um, bathroom sink because we need to start working on this one again. <laughs> um, I do really like this total care, but goodness, that's a lot. Um, and then in the back, we've got some uh, rubbing alcohol, which actually, I think this belongs in my son's bathroom. I think that was um, over there. So I'm going to relocate that. Um, let's see. Oh my goodness. And then again, because we went to Sam's Club, and this was back last year, I think last fall, I bought a 16 pack of Dove soap. So yeah, I use this primarily for my face washing. So um, this lasts me forever. <laughs> I should ask my sister if she wants some of this when she comes. But yeah, so I, I put it in my husband's side because he has more room. Isn't that nice of me? <laughs> And then a box of Kleenex, which I can put it in our closet with the rest of the tissues. All right. So, and then the only other thing that's under here is this bin. So let's see what is here. This is my husband's um, little travel pouch. Has some just travel size samplers. And then we have some shoe inserts. Isn't that under everyone's bathroom sink? <laughs> I think I will put these in my husband's closet. Um, they don't, I think they just got stuck under there for whatever. Um, a scrub brush for the bathtub. Um, I guess that can stay here. I think I bought this for when my brother-in-law visits. So I will put that in the pool bath. Some, it, it smells pretty good. This is the sport body wash. Um, yeah, it smells really nice. It's like a cologne. But anyway, I will relocate that to the pool bath. Um, I guess some extra shaving cream for my husband. And a razor. Let's see. I'm not even sure. I think these are handy wipes, but I'm not sure what this is. I think I can toss that. <laughs> All right, and then we have soap. We have soap. Oh my goodness. We've got dial, safeguard. Oh my goodness. Oh, more dial. I think I bought, like, I don't know. I think, like, a 30 pack. This is 10, or was 10 in here. But I think I bought a 30 pack on Amazon one time. <laughs> it's a lot. But this is what my husband uses in the shower so we do go through it but yeah we've got this safeguard more safeguards so yeah we have soap mm -hmm. i probably should see if my son needs some in his bathroom um i'll probably put some over there and then we've got this dial the spring water my husband likes the traditional dial better at any rate, all right, so uh, some diesel shower gel. I bought my husband some diesel um, cologne at Sam's Club. I think this came in the gift set. Anyway, I'll put that in his little travel case. <clears throat> it smells really nice. I'd never heard of that diesel brand before. Um, doesn't sound like it would be a cologne. <laughs> More so. All right, so that's that. So primarily soap and um, razor shaving stuff. So yeah, we're really kind of low maintenance um, as far as uh, products, which is good. <laughs> we don't like to collect too much stuff. So anyway, I hope maybe this has given you some inspiration. I'm sure it wasn't terribly exciting, <laughs> but it helped me accomplish my goal. <laughs> so maybe you might want to take a look at what's under your sink and kind of purge and 
sort to maybe get rid of some things or just organize. So um, maybe you'll find something you didn't know you had. <laughs> so thanks for joining me today. I have at least one other area that I plan on organizing. So I plan to organize our um, kind of pantry closet that's uh, next to the laundry room and the garage. So stay tuned for that. As always, thanks for joining me. If you haven't already subscribed, I'd invite you to do so. I'd be honored if you would join me on my Authentically Amber community channel. So I wish you all the very best. Many blessings to you and I will see you soon. Take care.